the three most important design considerations for energy efficiency. As much as we talk about energy efficiency in architecture, we often miss some important context. And before prioritizing specific design considerations, that's where I'd like to start. As it turns out, the government does a sort of census, but for buildings. The commercial building version is called CBEX, or the Commercial Buildings Energy Consumption Survey. And when we look at the data from these surveys, this is what we see. This graph shows the energy use intensity, how much energy we use per square foot for commercial buildings since the 90s. This is for all commercial buildings. It's not correcting for occupancy type or when or where the buildings were constructed. It's just an average to get a big picture sense of where we are in terms of energy use per square foot. And the data does not look very encouraging. The average commercial building in 1992 used 81 kBTUs per square foot. And in 2012, the average commercial building used 82 kBTUs. 2012, by the way, is the most recent year we have data. The 2018 data is set to be released later in 2022. In any case, this data does not make our industry look particularly impressive. And note, by the way, that this is energy use per square foot. Over this same period, the number of commercial buildings has increased, and those buildings are on average larger. In 1992, we had almost 70 billion square feet of commercial space, and in 2012, we were up to almost 90 billion square feet. So the consequences of our lack of progress is underrepresented by this chart. 